Hey guys, welcome back. Today on The Untidy Artist, we're making lavender bath salts. Lavender is naturally very relaxing. It helps with stress. It smells very soothing and mixed with Epsom salts. They also create a really nice bath, great for sore muscles and just for relaxing. And I thought this would be a fun Mother's Day gift for my mom because she loves to take baths. So let's grab some supplies and get started. The first thing you'll need is some dried lavender flowers and I found this at my local health food store. They smell really beautiful and they're just dried lavender flowers. I was amazed at how much scent these had and they're just really pretty. Then you'll need some lavender essential oil. You'll want to make sure that the oil you choose is 100% pure. You'll find a lot that are perfumes or not 100%, so make sure that you check the label. Then you'll need a couple of measuring tools. I have a tablespoon measuring spoon, and then I have a measuring cup, just a one cup measuring cup. I grabbed those out of my kitchen. You'll need some Epsom salt. You can find this at any drugstore. I actually found mine at my local grocery store and it's very inexpensive. I've even seen it at the dollar store. So you'll need some Epsom salt and then something to put your bath salts in. And I found this cute little flip top jar that I thought would be a really pretty way to display my bath salts. Okay, the first step is to grab your measuring cup and if there are any big clumps of the Epsom salts, just break those apart. Measure it out and the good news is we are mixing this all in our container. So I just dumped mine right inside my little glass jar. And it would be nice to have a funnel here. You can see I spilled a little bit, but that's okay. And it fills it up about halfway and then I'm going to grab my lavender essential oil. And I add about 10 to 15 drops right on top of my Epsom salts. And then close the top of your container and give it a good shake. And you just want to mix the oils into the Epsom salts. So I shake it, open up the top, and now we're going to add some of our lavender buds. And it's already starting to smell so beautiful. So I'm actually going to add a tablespoon of my lavender buds and you can add a little bit more or a little bit less. Um, I was amazed at how much these spread through my Epsom salts so you really don't need a whole lot more than a tablespoon and give it a good shake mixing your Epsom salts and your lavender buds together. Doesn't it look so beautiful? And then you're going to take your measuring cup and dump in enough of your Epsom salts to fill the container. Mine ended up using another almost cup of the Epsom salt, so total I had two cups of Epsom salts. And then I'm going to put another five to 10 drops of my lavender oil in the top, and you guessed it, give it another good shake. And you're just mixing everything together. And that's it. Your lavender bath salts are done. This is one of the simplest DIY tutorials I've done. I have used these in the bath myself and I can't even tell you how relaxing and beautiful they are. Um, because this is a gift, I grabbed a piece of purple ribbon and I tied it around the front. And then I grabbed a little sprig of lavender and kind of slid that right into the top. And you can see I have this beautiful, very easy, very simple to make homemade gift for Mother's Day and I'm really excited to give it to my mom because I know she will absolutely love it. Thank you so much guys for watching. If you have any comments or wanted to leave a lovely comment, you can do that in the comments below. Be sure to give this a thumbs up if you liked it. And if you're looking for some other fun, fast and easy tutorials to make your mom a homemade Mother's Day gift, please check out my YouTube channel or you can check out untidyartist.com. And as always, thank you so much for your support and we will see you next time.